town and in the Amalfi Coast. Today we're going to go to Positano and it's a 20 minute uh, ferry ride to Positano from Amalfi and I want to show you this view because it's I'm like shook because a lot of these towns the houses the buildings are built on like literally on the mountain which is so pretty and I can't wait to show you what Positano looks like. I mean, you saw a glimpse of it in the beginning when we were coming here because we took our ferry from Naples and then stopped at Positano and then um, stopped at Amafi, which is the place that we're staying at. But it's just so freaking beautiful. This was, this is one of my travel bucket lists and I just can't believe we're here. So later, we have a ferry to catch because there's a beach club that I booked and I can't wait to show you what everything looks like and just bring you along. All right, let me show you this view. This is the view. Isn't that so freaking pretty? Look at that one. That. Uh, those are like houses. Let's do a quick Airbnb tour. So here's the little living room and dining area. That's the view that you saw, how freaking gorgeous. And then here is the kitchen, super small kitchen. And then I was like kind of worried, like where's the fridge? But the fridge is right here. Wait, is this a freezer then? Yeah, the freezer and stuff. Okay, anyways, come back to the dining area and living room. Oh, we hung out with our towels. <laughs> Washer. And then here is our oops, bedroom. And look at this random tiny window. Isn't it so random and tiny? <laughs> I don't even know why it's there. And then the bathroom right there, but Brandon's in there. But that is the Airbnb tour. Brandon, chilling. 
and the view is just insanely beautiful like I showed it so many times but you can't get over it I cannot believe we're in Positano plan is to hang out at this beach club because I paid $300 for the whole day so we're gonna be staying all day it opens at 9 a.m. we came here like at 9 40 and we're gonna be here all freaking day because again I spent $300 I booked this two months ago so we're gonna be spending all day here my hair is so crazy Okay, but anyways, um, if we want to order food, we can order food. And then we just press this button right here by the table if we need to call a server. But we live in life in the Positano. We're in our 20s. This is the time to come here. I don't need it. Let me switch off the curb, Brandy. I'm gonna come on your house. Got some bacon in there? Yeah. It's good. A little salt? Yeah. It's good. <laughs> I'm putting all the ice in there. It's gonna get cold. <laughs> it's so hard to scoop it from them. Brandy got a Moscow mule. Moscow mule. It is very strong. It's good. It's nice as in a mouth. <laughs> and Brandon's gonna pour me some water. Grazie. This hotel looks so bougie. I'm like very curious how much it costs a night. I don't even know if you could hear me. You could you could tell me how much it costs a night? Hovo de Saraceni. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that right. I'm sure I'm not pronouncing that right. Five star right. hotel. Five star hotel, of course. Because it's gonna be like over a thousand. Oh gosh. Over a thousand a night. Damn. Damn. I am looking like a mess. We are waiting for the ferry. <laughs> and it should come here in 30 minutes, 40 minutes. We're gonna go back to Amalfi. And today was such a nice, chill day. What do you think? Yeah, we just sat there all day. We put in the water. I napped a little bit. Right in two. Yeah, we napped for like 30 minutes. But so it was nice. We spent like seven hours at the beach club and the pasta was super good. I got a spaghetti with zucchini, zucchini. right? Zucchini. Yeah. And then Brandon got a sandwich. I got a chicken bacon sandwich. Like fancy. It's like a fancy. It was a big sandwich. It was fancy. Yeah. So now we're going to be waiting for the ferry and I really, really want that lemon sorbet. I really want it.
morning everyone we're going to a boat snorkeling tour and i'm kind of nervous because <laughs> this is my first time going on a boat tour but you know it's an experience and i'm nervous it is a four hour boat tour the person is going to be taking us um, in different areas to snorkel and Hopefully they have enough pool noodles because I'm gonna need that pool noodle to help myself float because I don't really know how to swim. <laughs> I mean, I can float on my back, but like it's so hard for me to like swim swim, you know? So that's why I'm pretty nervous. Also, I'm not gonna take my camera with me. I'm just gonna vlog on my phone. I'm like still thinking if I should bring my camera or not because again, I'm like nervous just in case like if I accidentally drop my camera in the ocean but i'm gonna share everything and vlog everything as much as i can it's not like a private tour there's gonna be probably six or seven other people um doing the snorkel with us our snorkel starts at 9 30 a.m i think it's like eight something right now we're gonna go down to the harbor and because that's where we're gonna meet up and it doesn't end until 1 30. <laughs> i'm like nervous but I will catch you guys later. And I know I, I realized like I didn't really vlog that much here because in, in El Mafi, like I knew that we're just gonna have a relaxation beach time and not a lot of walking compared to like the other places that we've been to. But yeah, I'll just talk to you guys later and see how it goes. Just wearing this blouse thing. And then I got my bikini and then the beach pants. I love these beach pants. I'm looking tired. in our airbnb i showered changed um it's basically our siesta and the snorkeling boat tour was so freaking nice we went to two different snorkeling spots and they had fresh fruits like fresh melon and it was so refreshing and he had different drinks and he popped some champagne and he gave us a, a limoncello shots and i did i t i took a sip of that limoncello shot i'm like mm -mm, no i haven't even had breakfast like a proper meal so like i'm like i cannot take a shot right now it's like early in the morning so i told brandon to put it away it, it was such a great experience and i was kind of nervous that i i about the snorkeling part because i don't really know how to swim but thankfully he had a lot of pool noodles and I use the pool noodle just to float around, just relax, and just having a good time. And the views on the boat is so freaking nice because you do go a little bit closer. Well, he was showing us like the different hotels and talking about it and talk about like the caves. And there was a one hotel where he was like, this hotel is like the most fanciest in Amafi and it was like 3,000 something a night. I'm like, Psh and we were like oh gosh it's like three thousand something dollars a night that's insane <sighs> while we were on 
the boat i was just thinking how i feel so so grateful to be able to experience this because it is my first time going on that boat tour and like snorkeling and i like almost like teared a little bit in the beginning because i'm like the views are so beautiful and i just like can't believe that we're here and i can't believe i'm i get to experience this and then i started thinking about like I'm like thinking about, oh, I'm so grateful that my, my grandparents immigrated to the US. I'm so glad like my, my mom had me. I'm like, I don't know. I just like went deep in my thoughts because I'm just like so grateful to be here. And the four hours went by so freaking fast. It flew by. I was kind of worried about that. I was like, dang, 9.30 to like 1.30, that's pretty long. But it went by so fast, so it didn't seem like it was four hours. It actually felt like two hours. Yesterday and today was definitely the most bougiest that we've done this out of this whole trip. And these were like the things that I've been looking forward to. And I booked these, like I booked the boat tour a couple months ago. And then yesterday when we were at the beach club, I booked that two months ago. And like this was one of the things I was looking forward to. There's one more that I'm very, very excited for. And that is, in, that's Santorini. And then that'll be my last vlog. Like it's crazy how fast time is flying. We're gonna think of what to eat. Cause again, we haven't had a proper meal. We've been eating like chips, croissants, and we had a gelato coming back to our Airbnb. We're gonna find a place to eat an early dinner probably. We check out tomorrow, which is crazy. Crazy how fast time flies. And then I will be filming a Naples and Capri vlog. So stay tuned for that. But hopefully you enjoy this video. If you have any questions about like where I booked my trip, actually I will link the um, exact boat tour in the description box if you are interested, if you ever come because the boat tour guy, he's very, he's pretty funny. He knows his stuff and um he definitely made the boat tour ride smooth and fun dinner early early ass dinner yeah we're not we didn't have your head just, is cut off we just had croissants and chips mr brandon molly is finally tan <laughs> you ain't a ghost anymore like my hair, it's all white because my hair is Yeah.